world obsessed with beauty, Netflix's Uglies presents a society where leaders mandate mandatory transformation surgery at age 16 to eliminate physical disparities and achieve peace. Tally Youngblood eagerly awaits the surgery, while Shea rebels against the practice and joins the Woods Rebels. Tally is sent to infiltrate the rebels, but discovers the regime's lies and joins them. To escape the regime's control, they must fight back, requiring significant power and resources. Tally is prepared to make a major sacrifice to save the day. Tally is sent to find the rebels in their hidden colony, the Smoke, to save her friend, Shay. However, she discovers that the Smoke's inhabitants are fighting for a greater cause and willingly joined. Despite Tally's change of heart, Cable's forces locate the Smoke and capture everyone, including Shay. Cable punishes them by transforming them into pretties, a fate Shay dreaded. Witnessing Shay's transformation devastates Tally, as she feels responsible for her friend's suffering. While the others escape, Shay and Tally are taken by Cable. Since Shay shows no resistance to the surgery's effects, she is deemed harmless and sent back to live as a pretty. Her friends plan to save her in the future, but until then, Shay remains trapped in the artificial happiness of being pretty. Tally's parents revealed the cure for the lesions caused by the pretty transformation surgery, which Cable seeks to destroy. Maddie, Tally's mother, creates the cure but lacks human subjects to test it on, as pretties cannot consent. Despite knowing Shay would likely want the cure, they can't force it on her due to ethical concerns. Feeling guilty, Tally volunteers to undergo the surgery and become a pretty, allowing Maddie to test a cure on her, even if she resists as a pretty. Tally's sacrifice aims to save Shay and redeem herself for her past actions. Tally agrees to undergo the pretty surgery and become a test subject for the cure, despite David's concerns about her changing her mind. She assures him that she will give him a sign to indicate her true wishes. After the surgery, Tally appears to have embraced her new life in the city, but the camera reveals that she has kept a scar from her childhood, symbolizing her promise to David and her desire to retain her true self. Paris, who also underwent the surgery, has his scar removed, but still retains his true nature deep within. Tally's scar serves as a sign of her humanity and a way for her to communicate her consent for the cure. It represents her determination to hold on to her past and her connection to her friends and the rebellion, even after being transformed by the pretty surgery. What happened to Paris is he dead? Tally utilizes Paris, her greatest weapon, to help Dr. Cable rescue Shay from the smoke when she declines to assist her. And the only person who could persuade Tally to turn on Shay was her best friend. Even if he was effective, speaking with Tally caused Paris to stray just a little bit from his pretty-mindedness. Dr. Cable informed him that this occasionally occurred for certain fresh pretties and that he is one of the unique few whose minds are capable of more. Thus, she had him re-operated upon, transforming him into a superhuman soldier known as a special. The Netflix series Uglies did not go into great detail to define a special, and Paris's transformation into one never occurred in Westerfeld's novel. But this turn of events gave Tally the exceptional chance to witness the extent her city would go to maintain power. Special's views are changed, albeit in the opposite way from Pretty's. The special operation makes a person more aggressive rather than calm and meek. This is the reason Paris fought David at the end of Uglies, even after Tally had almost convinced him to do so. Paris's major altercation with David ultimately resulted in his falling off the dam, and it didn't seem like he would survive. Specials, on the other hand, are designed to be nearly unbreakable. They heal at a startling rate and have reinforced practically impenetrable skeletons. Since Paris had only just recognized himself before the edge shattered under his fingertips, it would be immensely gratifying if a prospective Uglies sequel revealed that he had actually survived the fall. David told Tally she was gorgeous before she left for the city to become pretty at the end of Uglies. This is significant because, had Tally not had her experience at the smoke, it would have been completely unimaginable. Even the most beautiful people in the real world would have been viewed as unattractive and uglies because of the operation, which rendered every person very lovely. Individuals such as Tally were socialized to think that anything less than ideal was repulsive. The residents of uglies were already brainwashed, even in the absence of the lesions. 
David, on the other hand, grew up surrounded by the wild world outside of the city. He was able to recognize Tally's inherent beauty since he had not been socialized to expect perfection. Tally had started to reverse her conditioning if she actually believed him. Of course, there's a certain lyrical irony in the fact that Tally didn't fully embrace her inherent beauty until shortly before realizing her long-held goal of being a pretty. A poorly conceived and disturbing movie that fails to take itself seriously. The film's premise involves a future where eugenics is used to create an oppressive caste system, but the execution is so inept that it becomes unintentionally comical. The characters are one-dimensional and the acting is wooden with even talented actors like Laverne Cox struggling to make sense of their roles. The film's visuals are depressingly devoid of flair, with generic and laughable CGI effects that look like a mid-tier PlayStation 3 game. The movie's only saving grace is its unintentionally wacky moments, such as a scene where the protagonist finds a conveniently placed bungee jacket sign while trying to escape.